All right, continuing with the trend. Anthony has a personal break. It's Star Wars Skywalker Saga because that is what DC does best. He just pulls stupid stuff out of here. And we mean stupid in a really smart way. Let's do the same. All right, we are going to buzz through this because we are looking for autos, printing plates, numbered cards, which I can identify easily, uh, and art cards and other things. Yeah, no, that's, that's okay. I realized what you meant, Jeff, after I had already said it. And then it dawned on me who asked the question. I, uh, I read it before I actually looked and saw who said it. So, yeah, no, we're good. We'll get the other ones done. These are going to be between probably 8 and 10 minutes. Um, unless, obviously, we hit like a one-of-one... Carrie Fisher, then we'll probably be here for a half hour staring at the card. And I will be debating if you guys could catch me before I left. I'm kidding. I would never do that. I have integrity. Y'all should know that by now. <laughs> if I can pull a Hamel or Hamel, depending on how you pronounce it. If I can pull a Hamel and a Samuel Jackson in the same night, I truthfully would probably say I'm not going to open anymore. I'd have to stop. I would, I would have to say, guys, open it yourself. I think I'm done. Out of 99, I'd have to be done. I want to be like Barry Sanders. I want to retire top of my game. I would literally be like breaking it home. I'd have to consider it. I would. Vince, you know I'm serious. I would have to consider walking away from Skywalker Saga. Oh, here we go. That's number one out of 50. That is a galactic TIE fighter. Yeah, you guys get the giggles until they're like, uh, there is a ban on Skywalker Saga. Just watch. If it happens, expect the ban. I would walk away. I would sign my name in the concrete outside, and I would walk away from Skywalker. That would be it. I would exclusively break for myself at my home where I keep everything, because you probably would have sapped all the luck that I have built up in. And I would do everything to gain it back for my own personal collection. There would be riots in the chat room. <laughs> It'd be pandemonium. DC walked away from his bread and butter. Man, he was at the top of his game. Gotta respect that. Uh, Vince, you're up next. And then I got to look at the other two. Which one came first? I th think Jeff uh, is after Vince. As a matter of fact, I'm almost positive Jeff was after Vince because Jeff's been there for a while. But fear not, we'll get to everything.
Out of 99, plagued by nightmares. <laughs> it would be... <laughs> it, it would be narrated by uh, Morgan Freeman. I love DC. DC left the game right when he was on top. You gotta respect the man for how he did. Uh, a TIE Fighter out of 50 schematic. Pretty darn good so far. Waiting on the auto. Hopefully we don't have to wait till the last pack. Eh, I guess it really wouldn't matter. We're all going to be watching anyway. And it is in my hand. It is none other than the Katie Cartwheel. Also known as Rio Durant. Somebody was actually in a suit climbing around the Millennium Falcon. And it was Katie. Anthony, there you go. Those are your four hits. Katie Cartwheel, Plagued by Nightmares out of 99, TIE Fighter out of 50, and R2-D2 out of 99. Uh, no.